Well, hey y'all and welcome back to the channel or if it's your first time here welcome especially i am sally i am a nutritional therapy practitioner and i'm so glad you stopped by before we dive into it just a reminder that slots are now open for nutritional therapy so you can shoot me an email or apply on the website to book your free consultation and of course our starter guide is now live um it'd mean a ton if you go check it out but for breakfast today we are first of all staying with my family over the holidays um and we had a leftover avocado because my brother and I made sushi the night before. So I thought to myself, I must go acquire some nice sourdough bread so I can make avocado toast because there was also smoked salmon in the fridge, which my parents said I could use. So I ran to the farm, which is a local bakery when I first woke up, grabbed some nice sourdough bread, and then I made beautiful avocado toast for me and my mom. Just smeared avocado all over it. I love to season this with lots of lemon, a generous sprinkle of salt, some pepper, and some smoked paprika, which you'll see in just a second. And then I put an egg on one piece, which I commandeered for my husband who had cooked them a little bit earlier. And then I put smoked salmon on another piece and this was ultimately a really high protein really satisfying breakfast moderate carbohydrates with the amount of um, bread that i had relative to the protein and the fat from the avocado and i've just found for myself um that i really thrive on having slightly lower carbohydrate higher protein higher fat breakfast it keeps me super full and satisfied and then i had my magnesium glycinate um really bioavailable form of magnesium and I made some coffee with my parents espresso machine and I just sipped on this um while I was getting some work done okay lunchtime this is one of my go-to's these days these days I will have it for breakfast lunch or dinner it is just some boiled potatoes um threw them into a big pan big pot and you'll see in a second i just put some water in with them and i put some salt with them as well but boiled potatoes and i had it with grass-fed ground beef root vegetables are really nutrient dense and relatively easy to digest so i highly recommend including them in your diet regularly um, potatoes in particular are really high in potassium just make sure you're pairing them with plenty of protein and healthy fats so that that blood sugar stays regulated so now i am throwing my ground beef into a skillet you can find really affordable grass-fed grass-finished ground beef actually at walmart these days so definitely run to your local walmart if you're in the states see if they have that as an option um because it's been a tremendous asset to me and my family lately but i just season this with some salt some pepper and some garlic pepper wow garlic powder there we go <laughs> served it up with my potatoes um and i threw on a little bit of grass-fed butter to those potatoes as well you'll see here in a second that i had a piece of chocolate after lunch it was the hue peppermint crunch chocolate um not my favorite ever but it was pretty decent there it is okay so a little bit later in the afternoon i was seriously in the mood for some ice cream so you know what your girl did she had some ice cream um this is like a super nostalgic brand and flavor for me probably my favorite ice cream in the whole wide world ideally i would have paired it with a little bit more protein but we were running a little bit low on groceries and didn't have the protein on hand that i would normally grab so definitely could have done a little bit better there but just remember do have grace for yourself um and you are human and it is okay my mom wanted to take us out to a brewery that evening so we did go to a local brewery and just tried a few of the different items on their menu had a really fun mead um which i thought was really interesting and then there was actually a taco truck there so we had planned on coming home for dinner but the tacos looked good and my dad and my brother wanted to meet us there so we had tacos i had mine they were steak with um cilantro and onions and some radishes and it ended up being a dinner that felt really nourishing left me really satisfied and was a great option for something when you are out of the house so that's all for to, that is it for today there we go thank you so much to everyone who has already purchased the starter guide um yeah until next time bye y'all